Hello, you are welcome to solve this math problem, which is x minus y is equal to 4, xy is equal to 4, to find the values of x and y's from these two systems of equations. Now, in the first step, we start by letting this as equation 1 and this as equation 2. Then, from equation 1, which is this x minus y is equal to 4, we'll take this negative y into the right side. So, it will be x is equal to 4. This negative y will take this side to be plus y. Then, in the next step, from equation 2, whereas equation 2 is x, y is equal to 4. So, from x, y is equal to 4, we substitute the value of x, which is 4 plus y. So, from here, x, we substitute this 4 plus y, then bracket times this y is equal to 4. Then, in the next step, it will be y times 4 is 4y, then plus y times y is y square is equal to 4. Then into here, we'll start by this y square, then plus this 4y. we take 4 into this side, it will be minus 4 is equal to 0. Now, to solve this quadratic equation in terms of y's, we'll apply quadratic formula to find the values of y, which is equal to negative b plus or minus square root of b square minus 4ac then over 2a then it will be y is equal to negative b it is this 4 so it will be negative 4 plus or minus square root of b square it will be this 4 square then minus 4 times a is 1 then times c c is negative 4 so your bracket negative 4 then over 2 times a, a is 1. Then it will be y is equal to negative 4 plus or minus square root of 4 square, it is 16. Then negative 4 times 1 times negative 4, it is positive 16. Then over this time this is 2. Then it will be y is equal to negative 4 plus or minus square root of 16 plus 16 is 32. Then over 2. Then it will be y is equal to negative 4 plus or minus square root of 32. 32 is same as 16 times 2. Then over this 2. Then it will be y is equal to negative 4 plus or minus square root of 16 it is 4 then times this square root of 2 then we divide by 2 in this part and in this part now into here to simplify it will be y is equal to this we we'll cancel by 1 and this by 2 so it will be negative 2 plus or minus into here we we'll cancel by 1 and this by 2 so 2 square root of 2 plus or minus 2 square root of 2 so into here we have two solutions of y is ne negative 2 plus or minus 2 square root of 2 so let's write here this which is we write into here y is equal to negative 2 plus or minus 2 square root of 2 then because we have two solutions of y so it will be y1 is equal to this negative 2 then plus 2 square root of 2 and y2 is equal to negative 2 minus 2 square root of 2 so negative 2 minus 2 square root of 2 now after we got the values of y which are two values of y now, to find the values of x, we'll use this x is equal to 4 plus y. So, from x is equal to 4 plus y, then it will be x is equal to 4, then plus y, which is y1, it is this. y1 is negative 2 plus 2 square root of 2. So, it will be x is equal to 4 
plus negative 2 it is 2 then plus this 2 square root of 2 so this is the value of y x1 so from x1 is this and this is y1 so the conclusion for this first solution x1 comma y1 is equal to x1 is this 2 plus 2 square root of 2 comma y2 is this negative 2 plus 2 square root of 2 so negative 2 plus 2 square root of 2 and to solve from this second solution here to find the value of x now from x is equal to 4 plus y so it will be x is equal to 4 then plus y it is this so y it is negative 2 minus 2 square root of 2 then it will be x is equal to 4 plus negative 2 is same as 4 minus 2 which is 2 then minus 2 square root of 2 so we already get the value this is the value of x2 and this is the value of y2 so the conclusion from the second solution it will be x2 comma y2 is equal to x2 it is this 2 minus 2 square root of 2 comma y2 it is this negative 2 minus 2 square root of 2 so negative 2 minus 2 square root of 2 so this is our conclusion for two values of x comma y into this our problem now let's check for only one solution we'll check for this solution of the first solution of x1 comma y1 now back into this our problem let's rewrite it our problem was x minus y is equal to 4 and x y is equal to 4 then from this first equation by using the answers from the first solution x minus y x it is this so it will be 2 plus 2 square root of 2 then minus y it is this so it will be bracket minus 2 plus 2 square root of 2 will it give a solution of 4 so into here we open the bracket by this negative so it will be 2 plus 2 square root of 2 negative and negative to be positive 2 negative and positive to be negative 2 square root of 2 then into here this 2 square root of 2 minus 2 square root of 2 is 0 so this and this will cancel so it will be 2 plus 2 is equal to 4 whereas 4 is the answer which is from here so this is correct now let's check for this second equation by using the answer from the first solution now from x times y is it equal to 4 x it is this so it will be 2 plus 2 square root of 2 then times y times y y it is this so it will be bracket negative 2 plus 2 square root of 2 then into here it will be in this will make in form of a perfect square so it will be 2 now let's start by this this 2 square root of 2 so it will be 2 square root of 2 this 2 square root of 2 then plus 2 then times into here also we start with this so it will be 2 square root of 2 then minus 2 now this is in the form of a perfect square whereas it is a plus b times a minus b now this times this is equal to a square minus b square whereas a it is 2 square root of 2 a it is 2 square root of 2 and b is 2 b is 2 so it will be equal to a square a square it will be this square which is 2 square root of 2 bracket square then minus b square b square it is this 2 square so it will be equal to 2 square is 4 times square root of 2 square it is 2 then minus 2 square is 4 then it will be equal to this time this is 8 minus this 4 is equal to 8 minus 4 is 4 now this is 4 from the this second equation 
So it, if it is correct for, for the proof to verify in the first solution, also the second solution is also correct. Thank you for watching. Don't forget these steps to miss out. Subscribe to my channel and see you in the next video. Bye bye.